What's good everybody, Weezy here back with another video and our focus this week is having a positive mindset. And you guys know I have my journal right here where I summarize what positivity means to me. So let's jump right in. So we all know that thinking positive doesn't come naturally since our minds are hardwired on taking shortcuts and thinking negative. Now let's be clear, I'm not saying that everyone is walking around all doom and gloom and I'm certainly not saying that everyone is the same. Some people are definitely more optimistic and more positive than others. But what many psychologists and just many people in general believe is that our brains default into the negative. So by large, we're hardwired to register and remember negative events more quickly and deeply than positive ones. For example, say a person has loved pets, more specifically dogs, their entire life and has had hundreds of amazing experiences with them. But that one day they've gotten bitten by a dog who they thought was friendly. And I can guarantee you that that one negative experience has outweighed all the positive ones prior to it. To continue, a positive affirmation is always encouraging and it builds our confidence to take on any task in the world. This also draws through law of attraction. When we think positive towards our actions, we then begin to see that all along the correct people, places, and opportunities has formed together like a jigsaw puzzle. It's all meant to be. We also want to be our own boss and create our own schedule, so why not put in a continuous effort to make it become a reality? Now, Tupac, one of the greatest messengers and one of my favorite musicians, once said, He is a message to the newborns that's waiting to breathe. If you believe me, you can achieve. Just look at me. Against all lies, though life is hard, we carry on. Living in the projects, broke with no lights on. To all the seeds that follow me, protect your essence. Born with less, but you're still precious. The smile for me now. Now we all know what type of impact he has made on people's lives outside of music, so I'm not going to speak on that. But to conclude, begin to serve your 24 hours with thoughts of positivity and pay attention to what the universe unravels throughout your day. Now I would like to share with you all five of my positive affirmations before you go on about your day. Number one, I can, I will, end of story. When you set your mind to it, there's nothing that you can't accomplish, so what more is there to say? Number two, I am in charge of how I feel today and I am choosing happiness. Sometimes you may feel like a slave to your own emotions. Don't. Remember, while you may not be able to control what goes on during your day, you can control how you react and how you feel. So on my J. Cole voice, choose wisely. Number three, I will not compare myself to strangers on the internet. Social media can make you feel guilty when comparing your life to others' curated feeds. When this happens, just take a step back and repeat this affirmation. Number four, when you really want it, you're unstoppable. Let go of things that you think you're supposed to do and instead focus on projects and goals that you really want to accomplish. After all, you'll find more joy in the process when you remind yourself of why you started in the first place. And then there's no stopping you from achievement. And lastly, number five, I refuse to give up because I haven't tried all possible ways. Can't stop, won't stop is the motto here. So when you feel like you're at an impasse, say, remember, there's always another way forward. So to conclude, guys, thank you all for watching this episode on positivity, and I hope you all take positive actions throughout your week, and I will see you all next week on Monday's Motivation. Peace.